it's the last day and things are slowing down a bit. I got to say most of my goodbyes last night to people who are leaving. We'll see some more today. I'll let you know what's going on as we go along. We're doing some first tower interviews. There's, uh, there's the seat there shooting. A little thing with Suzanne. Pretty exciting stuff going on here. Well, look who I ran into here. Last day, Rob Davio. And, uh, Hello. He's here. I know we're we're excited about a lot of stuff that you have coming out. You have yep. a new restoration company. Restoration games. Which is going to be great. Bringing back all those old games. Yep. How did that idea come about? It wasn't my idea. Uh, the owner of the company, Justin Jacobson, who's also uh, my lawyer, wanted to start a game company. And I'm like, man, there's a lot of game companies. And then it's like, but we're going to do something different. We're going to take old games, touch them up, put them back in print. And uh, I'm like, okay, I'm on board with that. So I'm like, a, I'm like the in-house chief restoration officer is the title, but um, uh, basically like an in-house developer. So we find great games that have been out of print. Are, and sometimes they were wildly successful, and sometimes they were gems that should have been successful and weren't. And then we're going to modernize them. It's not a retro company. New art, new graphics, maybe a new name. I'll go in and do some development work to make it fit 2017 as opposed to maybe 1988, where it came from. And then we're going to put them out. So we're looking for all sorts of games. Nice, nice. And any scoop on Pandemic Legacy Season 2? The one Next that year, 2017, sometime between January 1st and December 31st. <laughs> I'll give you a hint, it won't be December 31st. I will take out one of the days. <laughs> so there you go, you heard it here first. We're going to have Season 2. It's going to be based in 2017, I think, running from January to December. Okay. Anyway, we will see you soon, Robin. Thanks for coming on. Okay, bye. All right, cool, cool. Well... We're at the booth at the last day. The guys are getting ready to leave in about an hour, but Sam's getting in one last game of Onitama here. How you feeling, Sam? I don't know, man. The guy will be building. We'll see. The first time we ever played this game for the Dice Tower Essential. You remember that story? Yeah, I whooped you. Yes, I know. In a restaurant. <laughs> and right there, Tom said, we're publishing this one. <laughs> that is right. Instant success. Yes, Onitama, one of our favorites, Dice Tower Essential. And uh, we're wrapping it up here soon at BGTCon 2016. Tom. Well, that one second you saw of Tom was actually an interview with Rich Summer, which you won't get to see, but you probably already saw Z's tweet about how I forgot to record and Rich had to leave. But we love him, and seriously, if you haven't listened to his new podcast, Cardboard, listen to it. Go check it out. It is phenomenal, and he's a good guy, good supporter of the hobby, and just watch Cardboard, and or listen to Cardboard and enjoy it. That's Cardboard Rich Summer. Just listen to it. You'll love it. Well, the convention's wrapping up, and look who I found, Mr. Board Geek himself, Aldi. How did everything go? It went awesome. It did. Totally You're happy. happy. Everything was smooth. Oh, and, no, and my wife. Have you guys met Mrs. Aldi <laughs> and Michelle? Mrs. Um, Alden. M Mrs. Alden from from Noir, from that one year when there was the Noir game. How did you like it? I know you were here at the um, promo booth a lot of the time, but did you have yeah, a good time too? Absolutely. Yeah. Lo lots of fun gaming, lots of fun stuff. What's for next sure. for you guys? Going to uh, Vegas. We're going to Vegas. Vegas, baby. Yep, for Gamma? Roll some dice. <laughs> excellent, Thanks, excellent. Oh, yeah. even earlier. Yeah. Oh, have fun there. Yeah. Have fun. It'll be a good trip. And as usual, thanks for everything. We had an amazing time, and we're looking forward to next year. Me too. Great. So that's it for our, our lovely com head of everything, com not just convention director, head of everything, Aldi, and we'll sign out here from Board Game Geek Con 2016. Thank you.